1979 Lincoln Mark V Collector Series. 430 original miles. Yes, that's correct. 430 original miles. I bought this vehicle directly from the owner that bought it brand new, less than an hour and a half away from us. He was a bank owner, bought it with another individual as an investment. The car was literally driven, a couple parades, a couple funerals. The longest trip I ever took was about 15 to 17 miles down the highway to a different city and back. Has been started and regularly, um, so it didn't just get left in a in a barn. That wasn't the case. Uh, very well cared for. Was not in climate controlled facility, but was inside of a uh, a building with a cement floor, of course, and covered up all the time. We have installed a new gas tank in the fuel system, new fuel pump, had the carburetor adjusted, fresh oil change. Uh, it runs just like you'd expect it to run. 430 miles. All the original stampings are on the engine. Yeah, you'll see some marking in the valve cover. That's indicative of a car that was not stored in climate controlled facility, was put away warm, engine hot, cooled down. That paint does not last. It's the only thing you're seeing there. All of the markings underneath on the uh, bottom side of the car, we've removed tires, we've got brake markings, everything that is showing uh, original to this car. We've done our due diligence, so anybody who wants to be a naysayer and say this is not the real deal, well, you're not here. I, I want you to make sure you understand that we've we've looked this car over top and bottom, we've had it inspected, we've driven it, and again, I've got a video with the original owners, so it is it is the real deal. I just want to make sure you're not wasting your time looking at something that's uh, a copycat or people think the miles have rolled over because they haven't. Um, the paint. I would say shines about like the day it was new. 44 years old, it's it's not brand new, but it's as new as you're gonna find. I don't think there's another one in the country with 430 miles on it. This car still has the original dealer stock tag in the window. You can't read it, that's not been removed. Here is the original window sticker. It has not been removed. Uh, we'll start with the outside, uh, the wheel weights. I'm going to show you this one here. It might be a little bit easier. These wheel weights still have the original Ford emblem stamped on them. Okay. The original Michelin tires, they're 10 30 seconds in depth, which is about what they would have been new. Um, body wise, I, I don't think there's really any real blemishes. There is one spot up by the upper moonroof where somebody might have cleaned it, put a chemical on it, kind of left a little bit of a staining. That would be about it. It almost looks like it was wiped with some dirty, a dirty rag, but that's not the case. That's about it. That's all you're going to see here. It's uh, other than that, can't see. There may not be a watermark or a chip here. Uh, trunk, original floor mat sitting in the plastic. Have never been on the floors of the car. This came with an original collector's kit, a tool pouch, and an umbrella. They're both in the back just as they were. The Collector Series had a carpeted lid trunk as well. Vinyl top is perfect. The inside, there's your seat. Get the back seat lifted up here for you. Plastic on the rear seat belts has not been removed from the factory. We believe the back seat has never been sat in from what the owner told us. He was the only one that drove the car. Power moonroof, everything works great there. Headliner is perfect, dash is perfect. We do have some plastic floor mats in the bottom side of the paper ones. There's your odometer. Everything works in the car for the most part. The power antenna does not go up and down. It is trying, but I think it's an age thing. AC's cool, heat works. Uh, radio is a little bit fuzzy, I'm assuming, because the power antenna, I don't know. Of course, the wipers work as they should. Probably still have the original rubber on them, I'm gonna guess. It is flawless for the most part. Again, 43, 44 years of age is gonna do a little bit to a car, but there's your rear view mirror. You'll see some of the typical aging in the glass. But you look out the hood of this car, you're seeing a beautifully shiny 
beautiful deep metallic blue factory color with a nice gold Lincoln hood ornament encased in plastic. Um, all the documents are with this car. I'm looking at them upside down. We've got a Marty Report original sales brochure, original owner's manual. In that blue pouch is going to be all the documents from when it was sold new. The key tags, the original bill of sale, the original title from 1979 comes with this car, the dealer's inspection sheet, an Iowa inspection sheet, all documents including the Michelin tires, everything that would have been sold with this car new. It does literally fill up 